our issue that we are facing nowadays. Awesome. So basically, Infosphere consists of various data systems, sources of information, communication channels, both online and offline, including our own intuition experience that we carry with us, bringing that all together. And, and, uh, and, and again, all day long we talked about AI. AI will enable us to deliver those and make those business decisions, right? It almost feels like listening to both um, Soumya and uh, Anshul that uh, future of tech is actually software engineers running HR and not HR people running HR anymore. It just feels like that, but I, mean, I don't know whether that's true or not, but uh, uh, phenomenal um, uh, example. Thank you so much and very relevant to a product that got launched today as well. Um, Savita, I want to just bring you in here. Uh, Anshul talked about this infosphere and solving the problem of no-shows and ghosting. Do you have any experience of it doing anything which is more inward looking within the organization that you can share with us? So uh, thank you Raj and I know thank you for all of you for having patience to still sit by and look at us and listening to us. Uh, to the point where you brought Anshul, okay, I, um, I have a little different perspective. Uh, reason being pure HR BP role. So for me, employee is my center, right? Now in our organization, if you look at it, your systems, HR processes, all are running in the different silos, right? You have r and separately running, compensation, TA, or name a training part of it. Each of these HR process or in, in firm, our policies are running in different silos. Now for us, if we have to make that overall experience and give that enhancement for an employee experience or meet organizational strategies, you need to plug all of these you know, policies, processes together. Unless until we do that, we will not be able to take decisions in a right way. We all will work in silos say that, oh, we need to reward all the employees because they are feeling demotivated. Or we need to give a compensation hike or a particular skill for one team because that team has a higher situation or that skill is difficult to hire. So for me, what I think that we as in for us, as an overall HR, you know, holistically view, I would look at it. If we can stitch all this together, take the data driven decisions, I think the things will be very, very different for us to look at it. Awesome. And that will enhance the, not only the employee experience part of it, even as an organization strategies or the decision making, it'll be better off. Awesome. Thank and you. and Savita, I'm assuming that's already happening. It's not as if one needs to do. It's yeah. extremely manual. It's extremely laborious to do Correct. now. And uh, our friends, uh, uh, Soumya and Anshul will, are the ones who are going to make it easier with AI and, and bring those tools and technologies for us. But again, the point that we want to, even if you forget everything, Infosphere is already here. We already use it. It's not as if there's something new that's happening. But what's happening is technology as it's emerging and where we are coming from, we're bringing that, AI will bring that together, make it more intuitive, make it more easier, not as laborious and doesn't involve millions of dollars of investment and the time to build those systems. So that's the point that we want to make on Infosphere and I, I, and if please, I mean, I know we are at the end of the day, but if you think there's anything that we just talked about, if you have any questions, you disagree with something, agree with something, or you have a question, please raise your hand and we can take your questions as we speak and we don't have to wait till the end, right? On any other topic that we're talking about. I'll just pause for three seconds to know if there's any questions, any doubts, any concerns, any disagreements with what's been said so far. Love to hear from you. So no? you want to keep the audience awake, that's why he's doing that. You know. Anybody, have, you have a question? Sorry, okay. yeah, Questions? Have it for any particular speaker, please address. Otherwise, we'll address it together. No, no, I don't have it for any particular speaker. Uh, it's just that uh, I know the uh, for is audible now. Yeah. Is it clear now? Uh, I know it is just that uh, it's just that we are we are using this mindful techniques and everything to the work right uh, to make things smoother. But there are certain situations, whether for a corporate, for individual, that sometimes we get in a so much heavy load that even nothing works out. Like even if you try anything to get out of the stress and everything, but it doesn't work out. On that time, what initiative you take to get out of that? So if I, yeah, I'll just repeat and tell me if I've got it right. We keep making, I mean, 
sorry i didn't get your name amarjeet 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 says that we keep we are making those decisions right now we are taking all the online offline all kinds of data sets and sources right now as we speak and making decisions but sometimes it just doesn't work yeah those decisions don't work so is there anything that the panel has as experience